Hello everyone and welcome back to some more Manhunt Checkpoint. And it's time for some more, yes, we're just playing the normal checkpoint run now. Uh, where So I've decided to pick up a um, felt, so I've just run a red light, that was unwise because there's a Tristan there. Um, so yes, this is Manhunt Checkpoint. The idea is I'm trying to stay away from the Hunters and trying to pick up all of the checkpoints and the Hunters are trying to stop me doing that. I'm not actually allowed to take checkpoints in the uh, in this sports car because it's considered too good. Um, however, I'm allowed to use it to just sort of drive around a little bit if I want. The Hunters have a circle on the map that tells them roughly where I am and that sort of wobbles around as I, as I move. So the idea is that I can, in theory, make it wobble past me um, and make it hard, hard for them to spot me but more of this but but it basically tells them roughly where I am and makes it a bit easier for them to use the screen light easier to find me um, the hunters are generally in brightly colored cars so they should stick out so I'm pretty sure that isn't one despite it being roughly Pete's color um, but we'll see how this goes. see oh there's a, there's mark um, looking generally suspicious Come on, light. I need the lights to change colour so I can get out of here. I'm not going to go straight for the checkpoint. The problem is, what's this? Is this has happened before? Where Marcus? In fact, it was almost here in the last run as well, where Marcus pulled up nearby and gone, "Hey, there's a lot of cars here. I wonder if that's Lawrence and if Lawrence is in among them." And here comes Tristan to join in as well and block off, block things off a bit and just make things untidy. So, um, yeah, so that's green light. Let's go. So I'm going to drive slowly and carefully because Mark is right behind me. And then Mark is still behind me and is a bit more investigating of me. So I'm going to drive a little bit less slowly, a little bit less carefully and try to lose him. Uh, apparently by driving straight into the side of him and then into a, a traffic light. But, you know, we, we do what we can. Um, now, I've, I'm at, this is why I picked up the Feltzer at the beginning of the run. Because it is a faster car than he's got. So I should be able to get away from him without too much drama. Um, assuming I can actually drive around some of the blooming street furniture, that is. Um, my driving has not been brilliant so far today. This is this is our third run of the evening, and I've I've not managed actually not managed to take a single checkpoint yet. So apparently the game is a bit too hard, perhaps. Um, I don't know, but it, it it is a struggle. So I think what I'm going to do. That's a yellow car. I think that might be a hunter. There we go. He's going. He's going a different way to me. So if I go up here, yeah, he's still fo he's following me now. But again, what I was saying earlier, I'm in a, a good car. I'm in, in, in a Feltzer. It's properly quick, so I should be able to get away from any any hunters who see me. Um, there's a very strong emphasis on the should part of that, though. So I guess we'll uh, we'll see how it goes. So I'm going to nip down here and then to here. I'm going to stop at these lights, and I'm going to watch out what behind me. Oh, he's still there. Okay. All right. I'm going to have to run a bit further than that then, because he's still with me. It's a bit more tenacious than I was hoping. I guess we're going on a road trip, everybody. So, this is going to be a um, a bit of a run, and I'm going to just, just absolutely floor it because I've got the faster car, so it'd be silly not to. Uh, so, which way should we go? Let's let's go into Mirror Park because I'm not sure where else I want. I'm not idea, yeah, just because. So if I if I head up here, um, and if I if I drive reasonably well, then I should be in with a chance of getting away. From it. It's the driving well that's usually it's, it's, it's the, uh, the the problem with, with me. <laughs> it's um, can be a bit of a struggle. Yes, he's still following me. Okay, that's probably a good thing because I don't want him to try and head me off at the pass on the way out of Mirror Park. But I would like it if he was a bit further back than this when I because I'm gonna I'm gonna take the. Um, the emergency exit out this way. Oh, I wasn't quite going fast enough. Damn it! I was hoping to make it over onto the um, onto the highway down there, but that didn't. Happen. So he's, he's going to have seen me do this because I didn't manage to do it in one smooth movement as I wanted to. But yes, he's still behind me. But I'm now on a highway. There's oh dear, there's a hunter shooting, taking pot shots at me. That's a bad thing. Oh dear, he's got one. Of, he's got yep, yeah, he's got one of my tyres. Um, that's some quite good shooting. I'm. Um, I'm a little, a little bit impressed, but don't tell him I said that. So this is now going to be interesting because I've still got more power than the Hunters because I've, I'm in, still in the sports car, but I don't have very much grip or handling ability because I'm missing some tyres. So 
There's still only Ed behind me, I think, as far as I can see. So let's take this jump here and just... Throw my fate to the wind and apparently fall off. There we go, like that. If I now come over onto the other side of the road and head back again... There's Tristan. He's trying to get through to me. He can't because there's concrete in the way, so that's a good thing. If I could pull a turn here before he gets out of his car and starts shooting at me... Yeah, because if I kept going down the highway, then he'd have been in a good position to take... Um, uh, to, to catch up with me and stuff. But if I've come off this way, if I hadn't driven into that felon at least... Damn it. If I hadn't driven into that felon, then I'd have been in quite a good position. But there's not much... I, the car kind of goes where it wants to at the moment because of the missing tyres. So... I'm going to try sticking with the <laughs> with the straight line speed and just hoping for the best, really, at this point. Because I'm not sure what else I can do. Um, I don't have anything else going for me. He's, yes, he's still right there, right behind me. I could potentially ditch it into the sea. That's always a possibility. I don't know if that would help. Um, because he would be right behind me. He'd be able to swim almost as well. Probably just as well as I could. Um, I th think I'm just going to have to keep keep putting the speed down and, and hoping for the best. And hopefully he'll have some sort of accident to get in, on in, in the traffic. But that's pretty unlikely because he's got actual tyres. It's far more likely that I'll have the accident in oncoming traffic and then be in, and be in a lot of trouble. Um, I don't mean oncoming traffic. I mean in the traffic that I'm overtaking like this. Um, at this rate, I'm just going to end up doing an enti entire lap of the... Um, the city, because I'm uh, almost back around where I started from. However, he is mostly gone at this point, so um, the plan has worked, which is I'm quite happy about. Although he might, if he's got, if he's got any sense, he'll have, he'll have guided one of the other hunters around to front of me. Oh dear! Oh no! There goes all of my gained distance. Let's go back again him do that. Shoot straight past. He's probably spotted what I did, so I'm going to get off the road now, pull in amongst these cars and get out and hide. Hopefully. That's not, that's not how you hide, Lawrence. Try and hide. There we go. Behind that truck will do. Has that done it? I think that might have done it. I don't see him. I am also nowhere near the checkpoint. Um, nowhere near anything. So I'm going to head in this way just to get off the main road because I don't really rate my chances of survival if I'm still on the main road. I can hear engines. I don't like that. I want to get in the junkyard over here. I'm hoping he didn't see me. Okay, the maybe the only engines I can hear are reasonably normal, normal ones. Um, let's take this car. Oh dear, is that a yes? That's Tristan again. What's he doing? Is he turning around and not paying attention to me? No, nope, he's paying all kinds of attention to me, and he's pushing me into a driveway. That's really unhelpful. Get out of the way. Oh, this is going to be difficult because I'm not in a sports car this time. I just grabbed whatever I could at the side of the road. So, I feel like it's... The circle makes it too difficult for me to actually make my escapes stick. Because if I get away from them, but then they can tell more or less where I am. So it's then relatively easy for them to find me again. But I have to have a think about this, whether there's something we can do to make that a bit less effective. And now I'm completely stuck. Oh, suddenly a Windsor. I'm still stuck. <laughs> um, yeah, so I got away with that, apparently. <laughs> I'm not quite sure how. Uh, there was a lot of shooting going on there, but none of it got my tyres, none of it got my head. So I'll ooh, take that and apparently find Pete as well. That's a bit of a sh surprise. <laughs> Alright, so I've got three of the hunters behind me again. Unfortunately, this time, I mean, uh, I can't even remember what I got in. It was a pra another prairie. Okay, that's been a, a running theme for this evening. Um, oh, which isn't handling quite as a prairie should. 
Um, so yes, I've got a pra prairie once again, which isn't isn't as fast as their um, as their Cooper. Whoa, that was not. I did not intend to do a full 360 there. I was going to try and do a 180 and then go down in, into the uh, rail uh, rail tunnels, but that did not go into remotely in accordance plan. Um, okay, a little bit of braking meant he overshot there, which is good. Um, but I've still got all three of them on my tail, so um, I should have. I should have just kept going when it was when it was only Pete behind me. That would have been far more sensible. Uh, then I might have stood a bit more of a chance because it would have been me against one rather than me against three. Um, <laughs> uh, that wasn't quite what I intended to do to Mark there, but I will. Uh, I suppose I'll take it. Oh, this car's very slidey. Probably because it's not got. The, the, let's just say the wheel alignment isn't quite right, and leave it at that, shall we? I mean, looking at the back of it there, yeah, I'd say the. Uh, the wheels are not quite as they're meant to be. Oh, we've got green and yellow behind me now. Um, I'm running in straight lines too much. I'm, I'm very aware of this, but I'm also not entirely sure I trust the handling of my car to do anything other than straight lines. Um, uh, I'm not really sure what to do at this point. This is going to be difficult because, once again, they're all right there behind me. And... Oh, my car isn't quite doing... Oh, actually, that's not too bad, because that might be a tricky one to follow. Um, let's take a turn here and go up this ramp. That might have helped. Oh, I should have come off there. I was about to, and then I sort of didn't. <laughs> okay, so it looks like... I say it looks like I've lost them. Um, it's fairly common for me to think I've lost Hunters and look behind my car and then realize that's totally not true um, this however I actually don't see them so let's drop off here like that and I'm gonna get a little bit closer to the checkpoint hopefully unattacked let's go into this alleyway here um, and I can hopefully then abandon the car here like this and approach it on foot. Now the problem is they've probably s no, they've probably seen my player model by now, so they'll have an idea of what I look like. But I think if I can if I can walk up here, hopefully they won't realise what I'm doing, and I'll have a chance of actually taking that checkpoint. Now there's a big bullet s s blood stain on my knee and a bit on my face as well from all the crashes I've been in. Um, cross the road because AI hey, don't do that. Except sometimes when they're panicking. Right, those ones ahead of me are all panicking. But I'm going to reckon that maybe I'm far enough away that I wouldn't have panicked. I don't know. But I do need to get towards that um, the checkpoint there. And I then need to play, can I remember how to take a checkpoint from on foot? And I'm not sure I can. I don't have any guns. Oh, I've got a pistol. Oh, no, I've got a taser, rather. Okay, that's, that's worth knowing. I might be able to use that if one of the hunters is too suspicious near me. It might help me steal his car as well, if, if, um, if I get the opportunity. Um, I'm probably going to give myself away there, because I took the checkpoint. This is, is that a thing that's going to make a, an AI panic? I don't know. The hunters aren't looking at me, so... Although Pete is coming this way... Nope, he's not attacking people on... He's not attacking pedestrians. Okay, he's just stopped there. Uh, let's try and be a good little pedestrian and just go around the corner like this. I think I've got away with that. Yes, I think I have. That's shooting. I'm going to run. Now I don't think there's anything that causes um, AI to steal cars from other, uh, from off on on the road, so I can't, probably can't get away with doing that. Um, but ooh, let's, I could take one of these police cars. They will notice me quite quickly if I'm because um, I'm not dressed as a policeman. Um, ooh, apparently I am running running into poles though. So. Right, so let's stop here for a moment. There's one of them. Um, yeah, let's take the police car. 
It's going to be a police car with a broken window, but never mind. Okay, Life Invader and Five Ways are fairly close together. That might be a good thing for me, because it means they won't be sure which one I'm going for. Although so far, it hasn't been the going for the checkpoints that's given me away. It's been... I don't know what it's been that's given me away, but something has, and it's been unfortunate. <laughs> something has been giving me away, definitely. I think it's probably the, the location circle. Right. I didn't even notice him coming up behind me. That was alarming. Um, I seem to have kind of got away with it. The problem is, if they look in the car and they well, look a little bit like a cop, where is that FedEx truck going? And that FedEx truck. This must be some sort of express delivery thing that I was not um, previously aware of. There's Mark. He's been rather good at spotting me today. There's a green light. Let's go. I don't like the number of hunters that there are around here. It's um, mildly terrifying. So... <laughs> I think that might have been unwise because that might have given me away as a not actually an AI. But he was starting to shoot. And AIs panic then? I don't know what cops do. Um... <laughs> I'm probably panic and run away as well. I I I, I don't know, but uh, yeah, that wasn't my my subtlest play. I think this car might be burned. Although it's always worth it for an opportunity to try and run a hunter over. So I'm gonna take that and um, and leave the area. Ooh, this is five ways is just up there. Now I'm not in a chase at the moment. I am fleeing and I've got here quite quickly. But if the hunters aren't here. Yeah, that's their, their problem. I'm going to run the red light because I'm a cop. <laughs> that's what cops do, right? Um, I didn't have the sirens on, so maybe it's not. But yeah, I'm going to grab that one quickly while I'm over here. And then I think the next thing to do is to try and find a suitable car to change into. Um, there's often some... Where's a good place? I want, to, I want to do it somewhere off the road because it's... There's not, and there's often some by the... Um, yeah, here we go. Ooh, that's one of the hunter cars. <laughs> Let's take that, because, I mean, at the very least, it'll be amusing. It probably won't... It'll probably make me stick out, rather, and we'll just end up in a chase, and I'll end up getting killed. But... I think the entertainment value of using a hunter car is probably worth it. And now, if I want to, if I want to blend in when dressed as a hunter... Uh, dressed as... Um, I probably want to drive a bit quicker, so... Let's not hang around like I normally do. I won't drive like an absolute lunatic to get over there, but I will drive a little bit more quickly than I normally would because a hunter, if a hunter who sees a hunter car obeying traffic laws is going to get very, very suspicious. But a hunter... Yeah, so I think, I think driving quickly is probably the best way to do this. And also, it's not something I've really done yet this evening. Um, and the other things I have been doing this evening haven't worked very well, so I think... Probably driving over there a bit less cautiously is the way to go. Oh also, you can get away with a bit more damage on a hunter vehicle as well, because <laughs> they expect them to be damaged. Now, what's the, should I just go straight for it at this point? I think I don't. I kind of don't want to. I think I've come up here a bit too quickly, so I'd feel I'd feel bad if I took it this soon. So I'll continue on past it, then I'll flip round and come back, and we'll to give them a bit of a chance to get up here. So if I go over here, down about this far, and then turn around and come back again, and I can, and I said I can, I feel like I can do this reasonably quickly without feeling too too guilty about it, because if they don't, if they don't realise that I'm a fake mark, then it's their fault for not paying proper attention <laughs> and not communicating properly with each other. Yeah, there's was that the real mark in the uh, checkpoint there? I think it might have been. <laughs> yes, I think it was. Okay. Um. Are any of them chasing me? I kind of want to get into a bit of a chase again with them. I, I kind of don't because chases are so difficult to, to escape from. But <laughs> I also do because it's funny. 
Oh, this, seems, this, this driving a bit faster luck seems to be doing quite well. And it, it means that if a hunter does see me, I will immediately be in trouble. But on the plus side, it gets me around the city a lot quicker. And is generally a lot more effective. I'm really, really close to that checkpoint. That's that's not fair on for, on for them. I'm going to go off and change my car somewhere a bit further away. Because, <laughs> yeah, and that's just a bit too... Uh, it would be, it, yeah, it, w it wouldn't be fair, especially I drove, I drove quickly to get there, and I've, um, I've got, a f and, and I happen to go in the right direction. So, yeah, I don't want to, I don't want to um, make it too unbalanced in my favour. I mean, that's not entirely true. I want it to be in my favour, but <laughs> I don't want, to, I want the game to at least be fun and interesting. So, what have we got up here? It's a jackal. That's not too bad. I can't tell what's over on the other side. It's a bit too gloomy. This jackal will have to do. Oh, it's unlocked as well. Bonus. Exit this way. Even using rec using the uh, the correct ramps to go in and out of the car park. How um out of character. Okay, so I can get now. I can try and head back up to shopping center jump, or I can go out to airport loop. I think I want to do shopping center jump because I don't really like airport loop very much. It's a it's a difficult one to take. Okay, well I've I have stopped doing the um, the waiting for the hunters to see if the hunters have actually recognised me or not thing because that never works. It always goes horribly, horribly wrong. Um, so I'm going to just turn tail and flee up the wrong side of the motorway. That can only that can only go well. If there's some oncoming traffic, maybe I can convince it to um, to have a bit of an accident with uh, with Pete back there. <laughs> Um, sometimes if you drive towards cars a bit, they get a bit spooked and they become a little bit unpredictable. That doesn't seem to be happening very much at the moment, which is a bit of a shame. Um, but, never mind. Okay, let's come off here. The medical centre. Get back onto the... Yeah, get some control. There we go. Nice. Happy with that. Took, I actually took a corner well. I shall mark it on the calendar. Oh dear, there's Tristan coming the other way. Alright, normal car, normal car, normal car, normal car, normal car, normal car. He's got out of the car. Ooh, he dodged. I'm actually secretly impressed. He's got used to me trying to run him over whenever he gets out and starts trying to shoot me. Which, you know, I think is a perfectly f uh, reasonable response. If he's trying to shoot me, I think it's... I, I I think it's perfectly justified for me to try and run him over. But he's obviously got used to me doing that now, which is a, a real shame. So if I go over this at the right speed... Ooh, that was not the speed I wanted to. I was actually intending to go over it a bit faster than that, in the, uh, with the intent of getting onto the... Um, oh, dear onto the other, one of the top ramps. What's that yellow car doing? Is it still there? No, I don't think it is. Good, so that's <laughs> that's one of the advantages of playing against someone who's fairly new to the um, new to the channel. Uh, he's not he's not seen me do that trick before, so he, um, he fell for it. <laughs> or he didn't, wasn't able to uh, track me through it. Right, another car swap. Let's have a... Oh, shush, both of you. <laughs> is that the alarm going off in the car I stole earlier as well? That's a horrible cacophony. Right, let's try and get out of here without being spotted. Into traffic, like that, yes. <laughs> it's a rather aggressive merge, but you know, sometimes you have to be aggressive in these in um, especially when you know, especially when driving in the big city. I'm not waiting for a green light, I need to keep moving. I think keeping moving is probably the best idea. So I think what went differently with that chase, as opposed to some of the earlier ones, is that as soon as Pete came in to check me, I just started going. I, d I just started running. Um, because there's no point in hanging around because when he's almost certainly already identified me. Ooh, an ambulance. Maybe I can follow that. And the same kind of goes for whether I stop at red lights or not as well, I think. This more aggressive approach, I think, is doing me quite well. Uh, let's wait for that. Yep, there we go. That's another checkpoint. So, yeah, definitely the, the more aggressive approach, rather than trying to blend in quite as much as I normally do, definitely paying dividends. I'm I'm quite pleased with, quite pleased with it. Um, yeah, I like this. Now... Part of me is tempted to loop back round to where to that hunter car that I abandoned, that one of Mark's that I left in Red Car Park. What? They're shooting random people. 
They're not shooting me though, so I'm not going to protest. Okay, so I need to get to Beach or North Vinewood, and then once I've done that, that's the last checkpoint. This is going really well. Um, I'm quite close to North Vinewood. So they'll probably expect that. However, I think despite that, it's still going to be worth it. Now, North Vinewood, where exactly is that? It's over there somewhere. Um, I could head up into the hills and try and drop back down to it. I think that's... Or I could just head straight along this road here. Because this is the correct road. Yeah, let's try that. Follow this emperor. Maybe get in the other lane from it like that. Okay, there is the final checkpoint ahead of me. Hell yeah. That's not my green light, but I'm going to go anyway. There's a green car in the uh, in the checkpoint. Which of them is it? Not it really matters. They've both been quite good at um, at recognising me. I that was some awful driving, Lawrence. What are you doing? Yeah, that's, uh, I was pretty sure I'd given myself away there. So we're now doing the um, what we call the final hunt, which is where the, the prey has to prove that they didn't just take the checkpoint on, on a bit of a fluke, as I clearly did then, um, by just sidling through it at speed and not giving the hunters much of a chance. Um, so that means I have to now get a certain distance away from the hunters for a certain amount of time. Now, I'm very glad I'm in... A reasonably good car here um, because otherwise I wouldn't stand a chance but the idea is that I have to get more than 500 meters maybe I'm not sure exactly what the distance is but it's a dis a fixed distance that I have to get away from the hunters for an amount of time so let's say 500 meters for 20 seconds something like that so I've got Mark chasing me at the moment now my hope is if I lead them out into the into the wilderness one thing there's a lot more open space out here so it's going to make covering distance a lot easier. Um, and for another, most of the hunters, in fact, most of us in general, don't know this area anything like as, as well as we know the city because we've been playing we've been playing checkpoint games in the city for quite a long time now. I mean, it, it must be getting on for almost a year, I guess, uh, we've, that we've been playing some games or another in GTA anyway. Uh, let's turn my lights off. That'll probably help. Ooh, I didn't take that corner, like at all. Um, so yeah, we're learning we're learning our way around the city as as we as we play, um, but we don't we haven't played very much out in the um, out in the sticks. So with the obvious conclusion that nobody really knows this area quite so well. In fact, I know it so badly that I've got myself turned around and I'm heading kind of back in towards the city again. Um, I mean that isn't bad. It's 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 easier to lose um, cars. No, the mark is still there. I can just about see him. I've turned my lights off. He's turned his lights off. Let's do this. Well, he probably can't see me. And probably park up against a tree, but never mind. Actually, let's go forward so that I don't have my uh, brake lights or reversing lights on. That's a good idea. Oh, come on. Get back on the road. There we go. Right. I think there's a good chance that's, that's done it. Um, I now need to just keep going get some distance down. I'm not even sure. Oh, I'm heading due north now. Okay, so I am heading away from the city. Um, I've no real idea where I am. This might be Sandy Shores I'm, I'm, I'm head approaching now, but it doesn't matter. I just have to get away. And the reason we have this is to, sort of, to, prove, to um, prove to the game that I have escaped from the hunters and we're not in a chase situation. So if I'm, if I'm, yes, there we go. So if I'm this sort of distance away, then they're clearly not still chasing me. So, that's gone quite well. Turns out, being aggressive is the way forward. Who knew? <laughs> Violence is most definitely the answer. Thank you for watching. This has been a nice change. It's been so long since I've won one of these. Um, thank you very much for watching. I hope, you'll, uh, I hope you enjoyed the episode. You'll enjoy the upcoming hunt of you. And I'll see you in the next one. <laughs> see you then. I was uh, shooting out the tyres on his MX-5, because why not? You cause this cue, Mark? Uh, yes, probably. Uh. That gray vehicle disturbs me. Excuse me. Yeah, green. got him.
uh, white sports car um, in lower. What's lower? Heading west. Uh, where there's two levels. Oh. Uh, the overcraft? Okay. Uh, the he's continuing west very fast. Um, turning south. I crashed. Turning south, yeah. Uh, construction site. Uh, he turned straight or right? I think straight. In construction site or? No, no. Okay, uh, we're prisoners. Yeah, past construction site. I'm heading towards heavy port at the moment, but I don't have eyes on him or anything. I'm about to leave the circle. Ah, think... the Felzer. Felzer, Felzer. White Felton? Anybody? Uh, yes. So a white, very fast. Sport. Okay, he's in quote unquote under, the, under the overpass. Okay. Oh. Uh, heading to pillbox. He's headed to pillbox. I got this really fast. Yeah, Felsers are fast. This may be difficult for me, but I'm trying. Okay, he turned right at the bus stop instead of left, so he's going south. I think. What's away from the bus stop? West? I don't know. Okay, now he's going over the bridge towards Mirror Park. Well, towards Lester's factory. I don't know if he's actually going to Mirror Park or not. Over the bridge, over the bridge, over the bridge. Storm drains. Yep, over that. Over that. He's I'm not too far away from you. Mirror Park. He's in Mirror Park. Well, not literally in the grass, but he's near Mirror Park. Headed north towards Casino. Driving like a loon. I'm back to New Mirror Park now. Okay, let LTD gas station at the north of Mirror Park. Turn left. Headed southwest. Through the housing district, southwest of Mirror Park. Now he's headed southeast of Mirror Park. He's headed towards the auto mechanic at the south of Mirror Park. He's now doing the jump onto the highway at the south of Mirror Park. I see him. He's going to go on to the highway. Uh, nope, he actually jumped back onto the bridge, because he's savvy like that. Now he's on the highway. Okay, he's headed north on the highway, boys, towards the casino. Ish. I heard yep. shots. Got a tire. He's very, fa he's very fast. That's that Catch up, I may have got a tire. Okay. Oh yeah. He's uh, now on the highway headed uh, due west. Good job on the tire, he's spinning a little. I'm on the wrong Due west highway. of the highway, towards vaguely towards multicolored. We're not there yet, though. Still west on the highway. He'll still have speed. Mm -hmm. He is exiting the highway at the bridge towards Red Car Park. He may do a jump, though. He's old. He Ooh, tried to do yes. a jump. <laughs> I can't tell off, what he level off. he's on. He's on the highway again. Okay, he's back on the highway. All right. Heading east. That Correct looks like side. a Serrano. I, I worry uh, that we're following back. the wrong white car, but okay. Uh, on the T junction oh. south, but going the wrong way at the moment. Lost him around the corner. He made take the red car park and jump off. No, he's hit a car. Uh, he's he's on the south of the T junction now. Going across. Is he going to? He's not taking the jump into the construction site. Uh, Heading south, south edge of the circle, approaching. Uh, just hurtling along the highway. That's the thing. Uh, taking the exit by. Uh, oh, going straight back on again. Never mind. Didn't take the LS Customs jump. So he's going onto the bridge over towards oh, the side. The huge bridge. I might have taken. Oh, the jump. big bridge. Okay. So anyone over near oil fields that will be no one. Uh, now's your time to jump. I'm headed that way, but <laughs> nowhere near. He's about middle of the bridge, I think. I'm on route. The F620 is very fast. Ah, but he's car spawned in front of me. Ah, rude. Can't expand the map. 
Uh, he's approaching the red bridge now. He's, he's just gone straight on. I can see him going on to it, but I can't. He's way in the distance. My only hope is him spinning and being on the If anybody wants to try to intercept, he's got to be headed to the southeastern checkpoint. Like I would, I would assume. I, I see him heading along, continuing along the highway. Around the corner. Uh, he's, he's got to lose us first, because he's in a sports car. He can't oh. lose us sports cars. I forgot. You're right. I forgot that rule. I don't have eyes on him. I'm going to continue along the highway. He could easily have come off now. <coughs> I would stick to the checkpoint, because he's, if he's lost us, he's going to switch cars. Actually, yeah, I'm, yeah I'm at Squest Quest repairing. Pay attention to the circle and just shot out of it. I am, See, oh, I'm way out of the circle. When he came out, when he came across the bridge, he just ducked left off. I think off road. That's rude. Where? Docks. Uh, not so. Not docks. Uh, industrial. Here he is. Uh, I don't. Oh, if In anyone's done Cayo Perico, it's the place where you get the. Uh, oh, stuff. right there. Black uh, fuselage. Yeah. I believe. No, it's heading not a fuselage. Uh, heading north. Uh, it was factory. Industrial. I don't know where the Cayo Perico shit is off the top of my head. Uh, oh, I just, saw, I just saw you. I just saw you. Excellent. Where are we? Underneath a, a, some sort of overhead bridge that I don't He's recognize. He's We're spinned. near ammunition get or out? a block over. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, fuck. Reloading is it. <laughs> and I'm good. Yeah, there are gangs Gang. here. The gang killed me. There you me. go, Mark. Yeah, got him. What do I do now? Do I just uh, You should respawn. Yes, Pete, you got nice. him. Yeah, Pete. Uh, all right. I'm I'm done. Done. I can't do a J-turn, there's people on both sides. <laughs> <laughs> do I respawn my car or do I have to go back to it? Yeah, you, you can respawn your car. Uh, do I respawn my car? Uh, F5. Oh, we're heading west through uh, Ghetto. F5. F5. Okay. Down the main road that uh, right, the rails cross, and continuing west. If you're on control, it's holding select. Uh, it's not yeah, so he's doubled well. back towards rails cross. Uh, heading back again west. Uh, down the tram tracks. He's taking a right. Down the other main road um, east through ghetto. That's the hospital. Where is the hospital? Ah, oh, there it is. Uh, we are now heading east. Uh, we're at the train tracks now. I'm getting out. Oh, I see. Uh, he's heading over the bridge towards industrial. Continuing straight towards oil fields. He has taken a left towards Mirror Park. We are heading from oil fields towards Mirror Park direction. He's going off road towards the highway. Oh god, the tree! I have spun, no eyes. Does this cast? Spins like nothing. Fuck my life, that tree. Uh, I think he's headed south on highway. I, I'm guessing here. Because I, I think I saw him jump. I'll head down south, see if I can see him. 
Uh, I'm already on the way south. On the west side. No eyes. Oh god, I, I've got but nothing. He's moving down. He's going I east, think uh, he west on the highway. Brain. Okay. Uh, I haven't seen him, but the circle. It's, yeah. It's hurtling that one. So yeah, the south of the highway was correct. I so much more prefer yours. <laughs> oh, you in the Windsor? Yeah, I am. Yeah, they suck. <laughs> really do. They're an acquired taste. <laughs> <laughs> Take oh, ocean. He, is, he is here with us, Pete. Yeah. I'm yeah, going to take that SUV. Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> you take it. Okay. This one is also an option. Not the 4 before. The guy in blue and blue cap. He probably would have taken off by now if it was him. Yeah. Yep, yep, right That's here. Good. Well, what car? I think this thing, the gray thing. That's is it not the gray thing? It's not behaving like he would. True. That was the only thing I saw go through the circle. Hmm. Maybe you're standing still. Uh, yeah, I've got him um, by the hospital. Um, he's in a, kind of a Michael-looking character uh, in a dark-coloured sedan heading into the tunnel. Um, no, but he's taking the jump onto the highway. He's heading the wrong way down the highway now, heading east. Passing Arcadius? No, I mean east. Passing Arcadius. Um, construction site. He's coming off. No, he's not coming off the construction site. He's continuing on the highway. Uh, he's now on the right side of the highway. He's taking the jump down towards Pillbox Hill Hospital. Uh, traffic got in my way, so I cannot follow him. He's coming through the tunnel. What was he driving? Uh, black. Um, not sure. Ah. That one. Uh, well, yellow. Oracle, missing a tire. Black Oracle, missing a tire, heading uh, west on highway, right lane. He's taking an exit on highway. Yeah, I see you. Oh, he might take the jump again. Yeah, he might take the jump again. Nope. Ah, oh, I missed the fucking... He's back on highway, but I don't know what direction. Uh, I don't know where you are. He's, he's he jumped under me on the highway, so he's back on highway so somewhere. He did take the jump. Oh, okay. Yeah, but he missed the the bridge, so he was on the normal highway. I've got a car alarm in uh, blue car park. This one's blue car park. Yeah, I like red car park, but blue. Lot of red lights over there. Oh, I've got a janky convertible. 9F, got him. Oh, He's heading yes. to the hills. Black convertible. Oh, seriously? How would I crash there? Stone left, heading west. I'm so glad you were there, Mark. And took the next right. 
northwest in the hills. We're heading to the hills checkpoint. Okay. Uh, don't think I'm that far behind you. Uh, heading straight north on these uh, five ways uh, in the hills. Yeah. On the very top and heading through the hills. Uh, so not the, yeah, the... The actual countryside. Yeah, actual That's countryside, right. exactly. Yeah. Pulled um, right on the next section. I crashed. We are on uh, Galileo Road. Heading uh, yep. north, yep. northeast. West Galileo Avenue. No, Galile Galileo Road proper. I don't know where that is. Um, head towards Sandy Shores. Oh, no. oh, 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 sorry. <laughs> uh, I flipped because, yeah, terrain is a thing. Setting northeast. Canyon Road. Yep. So I'm at a intersection. Do you go left or right? Left, I believe. Thank you. On Beatty Canyon, Canyon Road. Road. Yeah. Yep. Lost eyes. Right. Heading down Canyon Road now. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you'll. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the episode, and I'll see you in the next one. <laughs> see you then. <laughs>